Hi there. So well, this is a cool winter's day here in Australia as we do the second attempt to fly a brand new twin otter. Remember the one I crashed in the sea? A little bit disastrous. So I'm playing it safe here with this brand new one that I've ordered and I'm flying it at the local park before I take it down to the beach to make sure it goes okay. So here we go, we'll take it for its first maiden flight. And this is an 850 milliamp, one cell battery. Centre of gravity again, before reversing the camera. Yeah, that's pretty well okay. Checking the surfaces to make sure that everything is working okay. No rudder on this, of course. You've got differential motors that control the, the direction. Remember the first one that I had, it had the worst battery in it. I ordered this battery, a one cell battery, 500 milliamp, but it was so weak and I lost everything, all the power, the whole works. And so that's where the crash came into it. I found that after flying it and then uh, checking the battery afterwards. So it wasn't a very successful and a very expensive way, but at least I've got some spares now, which is good. She's flying beautifully. I'm just giving it um, some throttle just around this park, this sporting ground. I'll bring it in for some very low, slow flying. Quite a nice day for a winter here. It's um, in, the, in the northern hemisphere, it's summer of course, and here it's around 12 or 13 degrees Celsius. So it's not too bad for uh, winters as winters go. And it doesn't get far below that. In the mornings you can get down to about three or four, but um, during the day you can get anything up to 15 degrees. I think 17 is our record for this time of the year in July. Okay, let's bring it in for a landing. See how we go. Whoops. The bird didn't like that. Motor off. Yeah, it is. Got it down. That's good. Um, being such a, a lightweight aircraft, we will uh, only mount it on the top part and reverse it then. So we've got it forward just near the um, the join of the wing here. I think that's the area that should give me the best centre of gravity. Let's just check it. Yes, that's about it. Okay. You know what I'm like with cameras. So we will see what we shall see. Now this time we're trying it with the camera just under the belly of the aircraft. Just got to straighten it up a little bit to make sure it holds. And we'll just uh, check it and see if this works just fine. Uh, it seems to be okay with its um, centre of gravity. Such a small little aircraft, I'm very daring to be able to try this, but the vision should be quite good. <laughs> Oops, no. Never mind. We tried. We're doing a reverse. See what it's like on the tail.
wasn't a much of a roll off, but uh, she's down. Okay, we'll just uh, give the battery a quick check, make sure it's still got enough power in it. I've got another one in there to try, a different brand, but I think I might just swap it over. This one, isn't it interesting that this one has the uh, JST lead? This one has a JST lead, but it also has the other uh, connector which I can check the battery. So um, we'll play it safe and we'll put this one in. This is an 850 one cell, 30C battery, 850 milliamps. Check the centre of gravity again before reversing the camera. Yeah, that's pretty well okay. Reverse the camera here. And I'm pulling the camera back just a little bit further back because I think that would um, affect that larger battery that's in the aircraft now. So I'm just double checking it again and I think that's pretty well okay. Don't you think? Good one. Okay, I'm glad you agree with me. Well, we did have some fun with this little one today. It's been great to be able to take this brand new aircraft, the uh, Twin Otter UMX. I ordered it because it was on special at the end of financial year sale, so it was good to get another one. My old one that crashed into the sea, at least I've got props, I've got wings, I've got all those things on there. Should anything happen to this one, I've got lots of spares, so that's really good. And I just couldn't resist getting this little plane again. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the flights and the different angles. And we'll see you on the next video with the Draco, the Micro Draco, coming up very soon. Bye now.